Finally, the right fasteners have arrived to this home just outside of Leipzig. Jürgen Loos and his son can finally add a second panel to their solar power system on the balcony. It's connected to their electrical system and can produce 520 kilowatt hours of power each year. It costs the family around 1,000 euros. The current power crisis convinced the family to invest in the system. You try to save some money, but that money just sits around in the bank. So you might as well invest in a solar system. The solar power system was produced by local startup Prewatt. Their order books are full, and it's hard to keep up with demand. Since Russia's invasion of Ukraine, we've had a huge uptick in demand for our products. It's unmanageable how many people are sending in orders. That caught us off guard in a certain respect. And it's not just solar panels for balconies. The demand for mini wind power units also has tailwind. Thomas Bremer has one of the units on his roof, in addition to solar panels. He uses it to charge a battery, so he can use the power whenever he wants and save money. We use around 3,500 kilowatt hours for our house. With a price of around 50 cents per kilowatt hour, that means 1,750 euros. So monetarily, we're much more independent. The manufacturer says they keep hearing complaints from power companies, that their profits keep falling, and that they're warning their customers from installing the units. There are also some bureaucratic hurdles in Germany. The German government says it wants to cut some of the red tape, but not all. And the flood of orders is hard to navigate, says Kai Toya from Prewatt. The global chip shortage was a challenge, followed by the coronavirus lockdowns in China and the supply chain difficulties. And now we're running out of raw material because of the high demand. The cost for the mini power plants may be on the rise, but Jürgen Loos is eager to see if they're still worth the investment. <laughs>